didn't tell me I'd be the only boy here. So? The odds are on your side. The odds for what? I'm 11! <laughs> I wanna go home. I thought we had a deal. Charlie, you can't make him stay if he doesn't want to. I love you, Dad. <laughs> All right, let's get started. Whoa, who's that? Your teacher. Come on, let's go. Hang on, Dad. Maybe we should give this a chance. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jake. Hi, Jake. It's nice to meet you. Yeah. Um, your uncle tells me you like ballet. Yeah. OK. How about you line up with the girls and we'll get started? Yeah. How about that? He's got a crush. It's like watching a dog chase a car. He'll never catch it, and even if he did, he couldn't drive it. He's still doing better than you. I'd like you to meet our new student, Jake. Hi, Jake. Hi. Yeah. Hi. OK, let's start in first position. Jake, do you know first position? Is that like missionary position? <laughs> and one, and two, and three, and four. <laughs> I will never forgive you for this. Oh, he's having a great time. That clueless knucklehead. OK, very nice, class. Yeah, good hustle, everybody. Much better, Jake. That's because I have a good teacher. Thank you. All right, that's it for this week. And remember, life is a dance. Live it gracefully. That's my motto. <laughs> I want to be a ballet dancer when I grow up. Really? There's a load off my mind. It's not as easy as it looks, you know. It's pretty hard. It's pretty hard to watch. Thanks. Did you see how far Mia can put her leg over her head? I did notice that, yes. So what do you think? Fred Astaire or Fred Flintstone? Well, he's got a lot of enthusiasm. Yeah, he gets that from me. I thought you were his uncle. Well, that's the whole nature-nurture debate, isn't it? <clears throat> so, listen, Mia. I'm not going out with you, Charlie. I know that. You made it very clear. My question was, is there anything more we can do to help Jake? Extra classes? Private tutoring? The three of us in Cabo for a long weekend? <laughs> if he comes to class regularly, I think you'll be amazed at his progress. Well, good. I'd hate to think he's peaked. In fact, we're having a recital next month, and with a lot of work and a little luck, we can include him. Charlie to base camp. <laughs> Pretty cold up here. Visibility zero. time tonight. Was it worth all the trouble I put you through? You tell me. Ask me again in the morning. Charlie to base camp. I can see the summit. <laughs> hey. Hey, Jake. What are you doing up? Why shouldn't I be up? Well, isn't it a little past your bedtime? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't have a bedtime. <laughs> okay. So what's going on? Not too much. Where's your dad, Jake? I don't know. Why don't you go look for him? <laughs> look, Jake, Mia and I are kind of busy right now. Busy doing what? Talking. Okay. What are we talking about? <laughs> we are not talking about anything. You're going to bed. Why don't we let Mia decide? Jake, sweetheart, I think you should go to bed. Are you sure? You don't have to decide right now. Your uncle and I would like to spend some alone time together. Oh. All right. You want me to tuck you in? I'm too old to get tucked in, you... you ass! 
ass face? Okay, then. Sleep tight, little camper. Men, 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 men